Hello, so in this video, I'm gonna have a go at learning to use the rollers. I decided to try and practice what I preach a little bit. So, never done them before, let's see how we go. Hello, my name's Scott Pearson. I help cyclists get faster on the bike, keep injury free by providing remote online strength training programs that work around you. Okay, so this is my setup. Uh, I've watched quite a lot of videos on how to do this, so hopefully they're gonna have helped. So, taking their advice, what I've tried to do is set up the bike near a wall. It gives me something to lean on. Um, I think I wanna leave this side open. I've watched a few videos that sort of said, do it in a doorway, something like that. So you've got a bit of balance both sides. Uh, I kind of feel I wanna have a bit more um, freedom I'm going to take to it a little bit better if I've got a, an open side here even if that means kind of falling off to one side we'll, we'll see how we go um, I've set the rollers up uh, so I've just bought these rollers off a guy on Facebook uh, 25 quid so really really cheap and cheerful um, I, again I don't know much about rollers so I don't know if they're good bad or indifferent but we'll we'll see how we get on with them so what I've done is I've set this up so my uh, hub here is, is directly over the roller and obviously you can't really change those so that's as they were. Um, yeah, straightforward. So I've already I've got my bike set up in quite a high gear, a few things I've watched people sort of say that if they're under geared you have to try and spin away and it's harder to get going so we'll see if that works. Um, I'm, just, I'm just wearing a t-shirt, I've got... Uh, Trainers on rather than cycling shoes. Again, I want to be able to, I don't want to be clipped in while I'm learning. <laughs> I think falling off is going to be uh, a big enough problem as it is. So, oh, the other thing to mention is um, it's a gravel bike, so I've got quite knurled tyres. <laughs> Obviously, not smooth or road tyres, so that might be crap, might be really loud, I don't know. Okay, here we go. So, getting on, I've just set a timer for about 40 minutes. I'm going to just pedal. Uh, and try and fall off as few times in that 40 minutes as I possibly can. We'll see how we go. So I've no idea how this is gonna go. Here we are. Warmed up, obviously, all that. Obviously. <laughs> Brakes on. Oh, uh, yeah, if it's really noisy. Uh, yeah, I don't know how it's gonna go. Right, leaning against the wall. Light touch on the handlebars. So quite a high gear. Off. Oh. I'm off, I'm away, I'm away. Oh. Nearly came a crop of that. Oh. So the other thing I've been, I've kind of noticed from a lot of the videos, people say pedal faster. Uh, yeah, look ahead as well. I'm looking down. Look ahead, pedal fast. If you're wobbling, pedal faster. Um, I'm going, I'm on. Uh. Ah. So I'm doing it. I don't really feel safe. Um, and I haven't got up, obviously I've got up against the wall. Let's see how long I can keep going like this for. No, no way I can change my looking. <laughs> uh. I'm a pleasantly surprised actually, so far. And I've only been going for two minutes, but. Total calories. So five minutes. So I managed uh, five minutes. Five minutes. Woo! So I'm going to see if I can get on without touching the wall. I think you need to see me fall over. Oh, no, cheated. I went to the wall. Oh. Ah, cheated a bit. Yeah. Uh, he says. 
doesn't seem to want to start with his right leg, so we'll go with that. No, no. 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 Ah, no, oh, that doesn't count. <laughs> Easiest way. Not like that, though. Can you bleep out swear words on this? Whoa. Miles off there. Down on the pedal. Let's go. Again. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was much better. Yeah. Ah, ah, oh, oh, come on, pedal, pedal, pedal. Right, seem to have got up there. That was all right. But I'm not exactly uh, balanced, but I'm, I'm, I'm pedaling away. Right, so I'm going to try. First thing I'm going to try and do is turn my left leg over on the pedal, so I'm on the right side of the pedal, because I'm just wearing trainers. Uh, then I'm going to try and get in a slightly higher gear and then I'm just going to try and pedal for the last however long is left, about 15 minutes, 16 minutes or so. Which you probably don't need to see because it's just me pedalling away. I'll keep the camera rolling and if I fall off we'll have a laugh. Right, so now I've stopped Jabbering on, Let's see if I can get this foot over on the pedal. Yep, stage one done. Ah. <laughs> right, gear. Right, so that's my gear I was in right to begin with. Wouldn't you know it, I've got a really itchy nose. Okay, we're on. So we've got 16 minutes left. If I can pedal without falling off, that's 16 minutes. I'll be made up. Not so bad. <laughs> oh, all right, so that's that done. Uh, no idea how that's gonna come out on the video, if it's gonna be good or, or not, but um, yeah, personally, really pleased. Never done that before, apart from like five minutes, 10, 15 years ago, when I was, you know, nowhere near. Uh, so I, I, with the assistance of the wall, I got up straight away, um, and a couple of times I got, just got up and pedaled away. So um, it's addictive, it's so addictive. Um, I want to just try and get going on and on and on and keep practicing. But my tactic is going to be little and often, and we'll try and do a bit every day, uh, 20 minutes or so on days where I've got other things on, and 40 minutes, I'll maybe push that on a bit, um, on days where I'm going to do some aerobics and cardio. Um, yeah, and then once I get up, then I'll, I'll plan a more specific session. So uh, yeah, really happy with that. So. Uh, if you've got any tips, what did I do wrong? What else could I do? Uh, let me know. And uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs>